Just like with most infectious diseases, if one is experiencing symptoms, they may want to go have a diagnostic test run to confirm whether or not they have that particular condition. And the same is true for Lyme disease. So if someone is experiencing some of the symptoms, as well as has a known tick bite or lives in an area where ticks are really common, they may go into their PCP to have this test run. And that test starts out by having some blood samples taken. And those blood samples are really important to look for antibodies that are made into response of an infection. So that means that they're looking for any type of reaction that our immune system would have had if it came in contact with the bacteria that's responsible for causing Lyme disease. And there are two types of antibodies that this test is going to look for. The first is IgM antibodies, which are determined in early stages of infection as well as IgG antibodies, which detect longer term infections, so one month or longer. However, antibodies could take several weeks to actually be produced by the immune system. So if one is experiencing these symptoms and has a known tick bite, they may have to go in for several rounds of tests in order to confirm whether or not they have Lyme disease. 